we go. We're going to do the transit bridge to gantry, Shabin Smith's sort of challenge type thing. Uh, easy Sunday stream, see how far off I get. Um, I have a feeling I'm going to be a long way off, but we will see. Won't we? Get rid of. How do we get rid of that? I want it. Oh, is it because I'm in the pits? Haven't played AC in a long time. So let's go for it. Using the hate shifter. Oh. Okay. Note to self. Do not hit that on the way out. Right, let's go. I forgot I was driving basically a bus. So. Let's go careful. It's a bit wider than your average vehicle that you might enter the tourist version of the Norwich Life in. Right, here we go. This one's a sighter. I've not done a lap yet. This is literally fresh. Just started the stream. Had the idea this morning. I know it's been done before, but let's go for it. It's probably going to be horrible to drive, but Right, there's the stopwatch. 10.23 was Sabine's time, so let's see what we can do. It's going to be all about momentum. And an understeer. Glorious understeer. I suspect I may be changing gear a little too much. I just thought this would be a fun little sort of challenge stream. See what I can do. Oh, and he's gone off already, sports fans. Can't have that, can't have that. Right then. I'm not that bad round Norge life, don't worry. I just need to get my eye in with the vehicle. Hopefully the timer restarts once I get to the bridge. Oh, find a gear, any gear. Off we go. It's a horrible feeling it's not going to restart the timer. Yes, it is. Happy days. So at least we know that's going to happen. Ten twenty three the target. We need to get a banker in of some kind, don't we? That was better through there, much better. Oh, I could have carried so much more speed there. Try and move the cursor out of the way. Bang it into fifth. Flat through here. Up in sixth. Try not to lose it into the big 
first braking area here again liberal with the curbs a low down racing car this is not foot planted up the hill let's go I'm actually going to lose revs up the hill I fear I may Nice and tight, not scrub, scrub, scrub any speed off here. So, how far off do you think I'm going to be on my first attempt? I've just broken 100 miles an hour in a transit van. Easily flat over the crest there. Slight understeer there. I have no idea of the corner names at all well kind of do but I definitely can't pronounce them because I'm an idiot oh, what, what, what are we going to do up here just down one gear the understeer is real oh we've gone off we're going to carry on let's see what we can do anyway I wasn't expecting miracles on the first well, this is the second lap, I suppose. But that almost certainly actually cost me time, so... Brake and accelerate at the same time there, because I wasn't sure. Down into fourth. Normally cars understeer somewhat down this hill, down this right corner. I don't think I'm going to drop it a gear though. No, just, oh that was great that, perfect. The rear just wanting to come round on me a touch there. Real understeer. Kept it on, no just. Kept in gear there too long. I'm not going to go up a gear. We need to talk. Oh, this diesel, the hill. Come on, come on. Come on, you beauty. I've got to say, this is brilliantly modelled, this car. Gets tighter through the middle there, but we're good. And we're on our way. Uphill, grab a gear maybe here. Very light inputs on the steering wheel. Don't want to scrub any speed off whatsoever. Uh, 
Look at the huge back section. Now the question is, well this is going to be flat isn't it, I was going to say, is this flat up here, very light input, We've got about three minutes to go. Trying to run it out so I'm not scrubbing any speed off. Don't think I'll grab a gear before the carousel, keep it in fourth. Carousel in a transit van for the first time. Bouncy, bouncy, and out the other side. Hear the turbo whirring away there. Trying to use all the tracks so I can just keep my foot planted. Don't want to grab another gear. Slight lift wasn't needed. Kind of just encouraged it to turn a little, though, I suppose. Miss shift didn't help. Oh. Keeping the lower gear for up the hill. Stay in this gear. Oh no, 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 no. I knew almost instantly that was. Oh no, he's, he's spanned it, kids. He's proper spanned it. Ah, oh, lap one failure. So we're at like 8.50 down here. So we'll have another go. Ah! Right. I knew this. I'm probably just going to be excited to finish a lap. But that was good. It was a good, uh, well, second attempt really, I suppose. But like I say, what, what do you think? Do you think I'm going to get, even under 11 minutes, do you think I'm going to get anywhere near it? Good exit there, out of the pits. Time to restart, and away we go again. Open to sixth. Down into fourth gear, bouncing over the kerbs. I was way too cautious through here last time, so. Using all the track, trying to get the power down. Staying fourth for this. <laughs> really, for a big van, it handles remarkably well. No lift, be brave. There we go. Right then, don't spanner it, Rich. Don't spanner it. Rear got light there as I turned in up into fifth. Use all the curb here. That was better.
There we go. I think that whole first sector was much better than before. Alright, we'll rev it out a bit. To have higher revs going up the hill. Hopefully keep that turbo whirring away. Actually, I think I'm in sixth anyway. Should have my gear indicator on. Yeah, I must be going this fast. About 102 mile an hour. Big braking zone coming up. Could have done one more break in there. I let off a bit early to try and let it roll, but right, I messed up at the top of the hill here. It was a bit of an unknown. Can be a tricky corner the first time you come through. I just touched 110 coming through there. Probably staying fourth here. Stay in the top band of that diesel engine. Oh, gearbox damage there. Shouldn't affect me too much, I don't think. Bit of a lift wasn't needed. Down to fourth. I won't snatch a gear because I'm slowing down here. Bit of understeer. Broke a little bit late. Into top gear. No pun intended. Right, slow down plenty here. This is a shockingly involving and fun drive. I don't know what's going on, really. Big hill here, so I won't snatch another gear. Try and maintain momentum. Using the brake while keeping my foot on the hard on the throttle there. I remember uh, doing that actually on the lap. that up a little bit I think should have been wider on entry but we are right in the torque and turbo band going up the hill gear up there It's only in a vehicle like this that you actually appreciate how uphill this whole section is.
back down into fifth. Three, three minutes to go and I'm at the carousel no idea if that's any good going to stay in fourth there we go down through this section. Let's try not to bin it. I don't want to change gear. I don't want to lift. Very gentle input. Smooth. Tiny lift to encourage the turn in there. Didn't need to dab the brakes there at all. Gonna stay in this gear up the hill. Just letting it coast round. Brake a bit more here because I messed up last time. There we go. Stay in this gear up YouTube corner. No idea what it's called, but all oh, YouTube compilations are here and people crashing. There we go. Miss shift. That'll cost me a tiny bit of time. minute to go from here. I'm not fancying my chances much, I've got to say. Keep the foot down. I think Jimmy Broadbent did this in like There's the 10 minute. I think Sabine's best was 10.08 without the Richard Hammond weight. Oh, miles off. And that's easily flat. Come on! Come on! Who'd have thunk it? Nearly exactly the same time as Jimmy Broadbent. I did make a note of this earlier. Where Where is it? I'm actually in shock at the minute. What is it? 1030, ah, 10.36.76, uh, 10.36.28 he got, so he's two seconds faster. So, somehow I have to find 15 seconds. Sweet Jesus, Sabine can drive. Right then. Uh, can I... I should have checked fuel there, shouldn't I? I'm gonna 
drop the fuel to eight because you know every little helps can I add 10 to 88 add text add source add existing source where is it there oh text no that's me webcam right target is 10 23 done then add text add source add new source cancel wait prototype regular 36 Jimmy B, what was it that he got? 1026. 1026. No, 36, sorry. Done. And then add source. Current best ten thirty eight done. No, nope, that's my webcam again. Okay. So then uh how the hell am I gonna do this? I wonder. Uh, so let's go for another lap, shall we? Beep, beep. Paid our money. Off we go. That felt pretty good as well, you know, that lap. Right then. Off we go. I'm thinking I might try and keep it in the three under, th well, up to 3,000 revs. Unless it just makes sense not to change. Focus. This is important. Oh, that felt much better through there. Like there. Don't change there. here I can see why in reality this would be a scary prospect to do because this is an absolutely ridiculous vehicle to be doing such a thing in that's for sure be liberal on the curb well dab of brakes Felt good. Up in sixth. And 
now we just don't want to scrub any speed it's important come on rich what's what's even more insane is I don't have any danger and this is how fast I'm going round you know what I mean like she could have actually hurt herself it's mental that's definitely better through there Touched 110 last time we're through here. Oh, I think we just peaked 111. Oh, the understeer's real. Oh, I misjudged that slightly. Wish I didn't do that. That's cost me time all the way down here. Don't lift, come on. I am going to snatch another gear, I didn't last lap. Don't understeer, don't understeer, don't understeer. Understeer a bit, we're alright. Got my corners a bit mixed up, I should have been full pelt there. Right, hard braking. Oh, I'm not sure what happened there, I think I missed a gear. Oh. Right then, that felt brilliant as well. Balls! Right. This may be the most frustrating little challenge I've decided to have a go at. Right, then plenty of speed because this actually matters as well, the approach. It doesn't look as steep over here so we'll speed with which I hit the start matters. Is the time not... Ah, uh, yeah. I got bothered then. Bouncy. Bit of understeer. Didn't feel as tidy through there as my last lap. Felt like I was absolutely nailing it the last lap. Yeah, that didn't feel as good either. Over a lap this long and a vehicle this slow, a little bit like that's going to cost so much by the end of the lap. I'm going to stick with it. Tiny dab of brake. 
keep everything in line. texting and driving I don't suggest anybody do that it's stupid and illegal right then come on why did I do that that's like easy flat don't text and drive right then come on Right then, this lap guys, this lap, I'm breaking 10 minutes this lap, I'm going to find, what is it, 38 seconds from nowhere. Oh, you fucking dickhead. <sighs> right, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Jumper, jumper, take the jumper off. That's easily worth 17 seconds. Easily. So. There we go. get to it. Thanks for joining me on my what will be pointless quest to try and match Shabin Schmidt um, around the Norge life in a transit van. Should be wearing my glasses. Silly Richard. Nicely through there. I mean, the line was good, but I could have probably carried more speed through there. Truth be told. Don't lift. Keep it pinned. Channel your inner Schumacher. There we go. Liberal on the curb on the right. Dab a brake. Keep everything in check. Back on full throttle. Should have been on that curb. Come on. Bit of Radio 2 going on, Chris Evans in the morning. I think that's who does it on Radio 2. Drive time with Top Gear. Right. Here we go. Gonna work just over 100 there, about 103. Right then, don't 
do that weird thing that you did last lap and drift over to the right, which I still have no idea how I managed, and brake. On the edge of understeer. Let the van run wide. Keep it going. Gentle inputs, even though I'm gripping the wheel like a man possessed. That wasn't as bad as the last time I came through here. At all. Sticking to 3000 RPM. Don't live through here, don't live through here, come on. That's it, that's it. Slight misshift. Selected sixth again. About oh, getting onto the power nice and early. Round we go. And hard braking now. find another gear there just concentrate on wheeling it round another braking section here for up the hill but we're going to keep it in this gear for going up the hill keeping my foot hard on the accelerator while I just dab the brakes there to make sure I got around the corner We're in fifth. Grab sixth. This next corner is super crucial. Oh no. Uh, super crucial. I fecked it up. I always think that one's a double apex. That's easy, cost me time there really got to concentrate on that corner because it's all about the time for up this hill which is all the way up this straight which costs god knows how many seconds I've normally snatched another gear by now, I'll do it just here I think grab that fifth gear at the right time there. I don't know if there's any point in getting sixth, but... Can I stay in fifth here? Run it out. don't know if this is the right gear selection. I almost certainly shouldn't be in fifth here. Just 
relying on the torque to pull me through as we go up the hill again am I going to stay in this gear? I think I am Lift, don't lift. Find sixth. Drop it into fifth, ready for going up the hill. Don't screw too much speed off. I probably don't know if I need to actually even brake there. Giving it the absolute beans here. Come on. On YouTube corner. Bouncing over the curbs there, using all the exit curb. Nine minutes, we've got a minute and a half to get to our destination. Uh, a bit of gearbox there. A little bit eager to say the least. Bit of break, did I need to? I'm not sure. Let's keep it full chat. Don't even think of lifting. drop a gear here I think am I no maybe at the top of the hill down into the mini carousel very bumpy we're in faith we've got another gear I'm not gonna grab it until I'm Coming back down, I don't think. There we go. There's the 23 target. Have I done better? Have I done better? Come on. Ooh. 35-45. Yeah, much better. Much better. So. Blooming heck. Right. Can we do to go faster? There were a couple of places where it's a back straight. I bet, I bet you can get three or four seconds on that back straight if you get that right hander onto it correctly. I bet you can, I bet you can make some time there because it's all the way up the back there. So please don't forget to um, like and subscribe. And such on the um, on the stream, very very appreciated. Uh, right then, we will go for it again because that's what we do. We drive transit vans around the tourist track in the Norwich life on Sunday afternoons. Who didn't do that? And if you're not doing it, you should either be watching this, or going and doing it. 
And I've only put Jimmy B on there as a reference point, not as some kind of... I don't know. I just saw his video and thought, that's an idea. Something I've wanted to do for ages, actually. So, let's be having it. Alright, come on. I think keeping within the 3000s is a good call as well. pretty good. It's pretty good. I'm feeling, I'm feeling good. This is the one, guys. Oh, don't lift. There we go. Brakes, get back on the power. Why can't you believe you're watching it? This is Sunday afternoon entertainment to behold, my friend. I just, I just know Sabine Schmidt is a complete hero now. Now I'm really, really doing my very best. Now obviously she's a professional racing driver, but and she's done millions and millions of laps around the Nordschleife, but still, from the safety of my gaming room, she's making me look a fool and she did it for real. Understeer is real. Come on, power on. Power! Low down in that top band. Can we beat 111? About the same. Right, I keep understeering here, slow down more. That was better. Use the curb, no lift. I lifted there, nearly every lap I've come through. I'll read that when I'm on the back part of the circuit, Jason. Uh, here we go. Snatch fifth. Break hard down the hill. Perfect. Carry more speed, slamming my foot down on the gas pedal. Perfect. Come on. This is a good lap, this.
keep him for, for going up the hill, could have gone through there faster. Dab of brakes while keeping my foot on the accelerator. Come on. Still can't remember which way the track goes. Oh, okay. <laughs> Right then, it's, I believe, the next corner, the next right-hander that I really, really need to get right. Oh, that was better. That was better. I was thinking that when I said it, but so far, we're on for a good one. I still don't think I'm going to be even under, well, I don't know, like snatch sixth just here, as the revs slowly die. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel and give the stream a like. It would be very, very much appreciated. Snatch fifth there. I'm not going to change up like I did last lap, but I am going to change down like I didn't last lap. I hope that made sense, because it did in my head when I was figuring it out. Keep it running wide, don't scrub speed off. Right, and I'm not going to change up either, because I nearly died to death through the carousel in fifth last lap. In we go. Oh no, should have been higher up the bank in there. Hey, how are you not subscribed, Slip? How are you not subscribed to Pit Lanes? That should be a crime against humanity. But thank you, it's very much appreciated. There we go. Don't lift. I'd lifted. I'm a pussy. Don't change up because I'm slowing down and then going up the hill. Slowing down again here. Oh man. I'm not sure I can go any faster than this. I'm genuinely giving it everything. No, no VR yet, mate, but Jason. Puts up plenty of videos of sim racing stuff in VR. Other priorities, unfortunately, I can't afford to upgrade everything currently. Hopefully, in the next 12 months or so. Uh, yeah, I can pretty much go flat through there. I've been slowly building up through there, but. Right then. In sixth, flat out. As James May would put it, buffeting. I 
feel like I'm much faster this lap. Yeah, definitely. I've snatched that gear way earlier than last lap as well. Normally I see the gantry as her target disappears. About the same. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh. So we found another second there. 10.34. I'm not going to tents. Screw tents. I'm just saying. Uh, oh. <sighs> There we go, right then. And the racing VR now ripped out my triples within hours. You did, I remember that. It's crazy that you just did that. So I'm 11 seconds off Sabine. All that for a second, mate. Seconds count. Ugh, right, have another go. Though I am near to the point where I'm thinking, how could I possibly do this any faster? Sabine is a legend, it seems. Not that I didn't think she was before, but you get what I mean. Right then, here we go. Right then. We need to get this bang on because the pace over past the bridge matters. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and like the stream, guys. It's very helpful. Cheers, mate. Bit of understeer, bit of tire squeal there. Still feels all right, though. Getting to know the van a bit better. And of course the track. on the right there. Up in sixth, up the hill. Fingertip light inputs. Put the car, the van, do the work.
power braking zone coming up. Touch of understeer delay me getting on the power there. That might have been the fastest we've been through there. Slight lift. I did keep the power on, but it was a slight lift. I don't know why I keep doing that. Got to train your brain. Probably keep it in fifth round there. felt brilliant. It's going to change down there, remembered which corner it was. change up there before I feel like this whole section was just better Speed through here, Richard. Ah, oh, fuck this up. I right, fuck this up. No! Ah, oh, I knew I had. I knew I had. Right then. Last lap. Last time. Let's go. I'd love to break 30, but I'm never finding, what is it, four seconds? Yeah. Right then. Come on. Let's do this. My right hand's actually going numb, I'm gripping my wheel that hard, I need to chill out a bit. I'm not sure, I'm not sure how that section was. throttle too long at the top of the hill there in that into that left it's just coasting through the corner no 
I was doing my head in. Lift, dab a break. Slight lift there. Didn't even lift off the throttle there as a change gear. Wanted the revs as high as possible for coming up the hill. fastest part of the track in this van about 103 mile an hour though that's pretty fast balls shift at least it wasn't up a hill so it's not going to cost me too much speed looking at that it's cost me about two mile an hour at the bottom of the hill there that whole section was much better at the top there keep it pinned around here drop it only one gear I think Perfect. Nice. That's the fastest I've gone through there as well. Hard braking now. Spot on. speed which I am that was less successful which is a shame because it definitely matters right then don't cock up this corner come on Yeah, that felt much better. I'm not changing until I hit three thousand. There.
going to drop it down to fifth, only second. There. Song. Come on. Come on. Change up because we're going uphill. Don't lift, come on, come on. You've got this. That was a lot faster. I always forget that one's a bit tighter. I don't want to slow down through here, which is scary. I did have a tiny dab of break, I'm glad I did. But that was a lot, lot faster. The fingers are crossed here. Good. I just don't feel like it is. I might lift off the gas as I change gear. Come on. This is my absolute maximum, I think. I'm starting to get brain fade. Thirty three. So I'm finding a second a lap. Sweet mother, that is hard. Have any of you done this? Any of you done this challenge at all? Oh. Let's 
go back into the pit. <laughs> right then, guys. That is it for me. Please like the stream, subscribe, come and check out our Discord channel. All the details are in the description. Let's pack it up, shall we? There we go. Um, yeah, everything's in the description down below. So like the stream, subscribe to the channel, come and join us in our Discord channel like the uh, Facebook page, Instagram, all of that good stuff. Um, and yeah, uh, we should hopefully be streaming and putting up more content very soon. But until next time, guys, I shall see you soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.